myself Nobody's stealing covers I like to drink to myself So I'ma have another no I don't need a hand to hold tight Don't need a love, that's all Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel Today we are doing a what I eat in a day My name is Des, I follow a pretty um, you know, typical plant-based diet. So I'm gonna show you guys everything that I eat and hopefully give you guys some ideas to try like a meatless Monday or a meat-free Friday, something along those lines. As you guys saw, I do start my morning off with a nice little lemon water. Don't have anything other than the lemon water first thing. It's just good for antioxidants. It's good to alkaline, alkaline, alk to alkalinize not saying that right um your stomach and it also helps run breakouts and acne it's just really good so it's a good way to start off your day so if you're looking for just like an easy way to start off your day definitely remember that you guys can try hot lemon water now i'm gonna go into my breakfast so sometimes i tend to have like an avocado toast something along those lines uh, this isn't long enough, but it's cold and all I really want is some nice oatmeal. So I have these instant oatmeal packs that we get and we have some. So I'm going to make two just so that it can be a little bit more filling for me because um, if I don't remember to eat lunch or sometimes I just don't have a big enough lunch and then I get really hungry. So I just want this to kind of hold me over so that I can have smaller lunch and then a bigger dinner um that's just what works for me sometimes like i just don't have time to sit down and make myself like this big extravagant lunch so a bigger breakfast and a bigger dinner kind of helps pull everything together so i'm gonna show you guys what i add to my oatmeal and yeah and i'll get started let's go so i stopped at starbucks and got myself a hot matcha i'm gonna add some cinnamon to this and eat it drink it while I eat my breakfast. Well, I'm probably gonna eat my breakfast first and then go straight for the matcha. Okay. Mine, but sometimes I just want somebody to talk to. Someone that's on my mind. I want something to talk to. And it don't waste my Okay, so it's lunchtime now, so I think I'm going to make the girls and I some smoothies, so we can take that on the way to go. Um, I'm just going to make some mango smoothies with some berries, I'm going to add this frozen banana that you guys saw earlier, and I'm just going to show you guys how I make it. Um, I'm just going to add some spinach. It would be better if I had baby spinach, but we only have regular spinach, and that's okay. Sneak some greens in. Also get my greens in. And then also, I'm just going to use this milk because I want to use it up so I can have an excuse to buy another milk. Anyway, I'm using this. I can't find the bottoms to like my other blender things, so I'm going to use this one. Make the thing. I just want somebody to talk to. Someone that's on the mind. I want something to talk to. And it don't waste my time. Yeah, I just want somebody. Just want somebody. I just want somebody to talk to. Somebody to talk to. To talk to. I wanna have some. I wanna have somebody, wanna have somebody, wanna have somebody 
dinner. I'm gonna have this Loma Lunda Chipotle bowl with black beans. Looks like this. I picked it up at Costco, which is like the only place that I've ever seen this. This is the first time that I've seen it. It's a Chipotle bowl with black beans. I already told you that. It's microwavable. It's not GMO. Gluten-free. It has nine grams of protein per, per serving. Um, all you do is pop this in the microwave for 60 seconds. You tear it. You, know, you do that whole thing. It's vegan. And then you just pour it into a bowl and you top it with whatever toppings you want. Alright, so our Chipotle thing seems to be done. Alright, pour it into a bowl. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It has some rice, some black beans. Don't mind my dishes that I still have to do. It's like um, this plant-based meat, some corn, some tomatoes, and of course the chipotle sauce. I think over top I'm going to add some avocado. And that would be my meal. Alright, and now it is ready. I'm going to take a bite and give you guys a little taste test because it's my first time. I'm gonna get some avocado. I'm gonna try to get a little bit of everything into the spoonful. It's definitely not bad. And for like a quick, easy dinner meal when you're tired and you don't really want to make anything, this is a really good alternative. Plant based eating doesn't have to be hard or complicated, as some of you guys or some people might perceive it to be. It's really good and it's super easy and it's also good for the planet and good for you. So I hope you guys got some ideas for some meals. And if you did, leave a comment down below to tell me what was your favorite meal, if you've ever tried one of these like plant-based protein bowls, um, let me know. Um, if you guys wanna see more of these what I eat in a day videos, definitely leave a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so I know you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. I wanna